First, you'll need to power up your 3240 instrument. Connect the power input plug into its socket on the rear panel of the instrument. Connect the male end of the plug to the outlet receptacle. You'll also need to insert the remote interlock key into the signal input terminal on the rear panel. The instrument will not output voltage without this key. This allows the user to wire the instrument to the doors of a DUT enclosure. This is a safe workstation best practice. Press the power button on the front panel of the 3240 instrument. The instrument will automatically navigate to the main menu. The high amp instruments have a versatile user interface that includes a touch screen and two push buttons. There are three main touch keys and two buttons on the high amp interface. Use the perform test key to navigate to the perform tests window. Use the back key to return to a previous menu. Use the home key to return to the main menu. The buttons are designed for operators that are wearing high voltage gloves. Use the toggle button to scroll through the menu parameters. Use the My Menu Select button to either make a menu selection or choose the My Menu option. To set up a new test sequence, navigate to the main menu by hitting the Home key. Touch the Setup Test menu icon, then press Add File to create a new test file. Input the test file name and hit Enter. Press Add Step to create a new test. Press Output Mode to select AC or DC. Press Enter to confirm. To change the test current, input the numeric value on the touchscreen and touch the Enter key to confirm. To navigate between test parameters, either input the value and press the Enter key, or swipe left and right to change parameters. Once all parameters have been input, press the Perform Test icon. You will be prompted to save your test file changes. Press Enter to confirm. The Perform Test screen displays the following parameters. File name, test step number, test type, status indicator, test time, test current, test voltage, resistance limit indicators, load button and loading test files, results button for viewing test results. Finally, we're going to show you how to connect the 3240 to a DUT and run the test sequence. For this demonstration, we're going to show you how to connect to a DUT using a universal style adapter box on a three-prong product along with the return lead. You're going to need the following accessories. The black return and sense lead and the universal style adapter box. First, connect the adapter box to the current and sense plus ports on the front panel of the instrument. Then connect the return sense negative lead to the front panel. You can now connect the return sense lead onto the ground stud or chassis point of the DUT. Then simply plug the three prong cord of the DUT into the adapter box. Close the DUT enclosure door, stand back and push the test button to run your test sequence. To view your results, simply press the results button. Press the individual step to get details.